and jury trials put on pause. In Jefferson County, many judges opting not to have in-person jury trials for the month of January. Now the reason? Many of their support staff have caught COVID. The hiatus has caused a big backlog in cases. 12 News reporter Gloria Walker tonight explaining why this decision was made and how the delays are impacting people waiting to go to trial. Continuing courtroom operations amidst Omicron has been challenging. Some Jefferson County judges have put off their jury trials and has now created a backlog of cases. Cases backed up and people awaiting trial. The Jefferson County court systems hit by COVID-19 causing courtrooms to shut down and jury trials to go on pause till the end of January. Judge Randy Shelton told 12 News Now this affects his courtroom in the family court system. Um, Unlike any of the other uh, courts, criminal or civil, we have a, a statutory deadline that we have to meet. Um, the cases are not supposed to exceed 18 months, um, and that's even with an extension. Um, so we've got a lot of cases that have been hanging on for a while waiting for a jury trial, but it's just very difficult for us to get a jury together in those cases. Clients are playing the waiting game from jail cells, according to criminal attorneys. Our attorney Ryan Gertz says COVID-19 has played a major part in the backlogs and the courts are doing the best they can. So, you know, this new variant has just been so uh, rapidly contagious that it's, uh, it, it's really kind of frightening uh, how, how easily it can spread, uh, especially if you had a, a group of, you know, 100 people in a room trying to pick a jury. And so uh, that's a real challenge that I think the courts are doing their best to manage. With that in mind, the courts are following the advice of health professionals. All of the courts are, are following the recommendation of the county uh, public health doctor, Dr. Um, Eddie. And, um, you know, he just said that he, he was thinking that we might start seeing a slowing down or maybe a, a you know a de decline in the numbers. Judge Randy Shelton is hopeful that in-person cases with jurors can take place soon. In Beaumont, Gloria Walker, 12 News.